Hey Gypsies, welcome back to my channel. Happy Thursday and happy Dollar Tree Haul Day. So this is the last of my Dollar Tree items. I do have several things here though, so um, we're going to have to make it a good one. Um, also, I just want to say I won't have one until Sunday again because tomorrow I'm planning on doing a Shein Haul and then uh, Saturday, it's going to be a uh, vlogging with me and Fifi because the weather looks like it's going to cooperate. So we're going to be going to Charleston. We're going to be going to the uh, Goodwill, which I'm super excited about. I just love the Goodwill. I just love it. Um, and then we're going to be going to like five Dollar Trees down there. So I can I need to to stock up my inventory to bring you guys these hauls, right? Um, just want to say all of my stores around me are now a dollar twenty five. And whenever I first heard all of this, I was like, that's not going to affect me. I mean, it's not going to affect the way I buy things because, you know, it's just, I just didn't think it would. But by golly, it is. Like when I pick something up, I, in the back of my head, I'm always thinking, can I get it cheaper somewhere else? And half the time it's yes. So I put it back. So anyway, I guess it's the name brand stuff that I'm totally going to be on the lookout for you know, to, to bring you guys hauls with, um, and the stuff, you know, the cool things, the cool thing. I've got some cool stuff over here. Number one, I'm going to start out with this. I needed a water. I'm out and about today and I forgot to bring me a water with me. And my, those great big ones I got, I love those, but they just don't fit in my cup holder here, which makes it difficult. I love these two though. Um, the Nestle, this is, I guess, probably my favorite water, just the Nestle Pure Life. I love that water. But even when I got that, I'm like, $1.25, you know, it's just, it's just ridiculous how, how it affects you. Anyway, let's go ahead and get into this haul. I've got a lot of stuff here and yeah, um, I'm going to start out with these things right here because like, I think they're kind of cool. Hold on. I got three of them. Let me dig them. Tell me they're all in the same bag. I mean, why? Why wouldn't they be? Like, they're, I just now checked out, and they was all together, but they're not. Hold on. Hold on. Let me just see what's going on. I don't know. Oh, I got them all three in my hand. Dang on it. I'm crazy. Um, okay, so these are kind of cool looking. So, I think they're a type of fidget. It is uh, distributed by Royal Deluxe Accessories. It says, squeeze and release pop ages three and up, non-toxic. So we're gonna open one and check it out because, you know, I wanna see what it does. But these are the ones I got. They also had regular colors like orange, red, blue, and green from what I remember. But of course, you know, these right here are double color. We got orange and purple, purple and pink, which is my fave, and then um, orange and pink, orange and pink, orange and purple, yes, and purple and pink. We are going to open the purple and pink just to see what it does, because I'm curious. I'm sure it's just like a type of fidget, so let's check it out. Oh, it feels neat. It feels cool. Let's see. I'm just going to throw that trash up there. So, it feels rubbery. See that? You can see how it's moving? Rubbery. So, let's see. It looks like two suction cups. So you press them until they stick together. Then maybe you press that side. Uh, or you just let it pop itself. I think you, you pop it yourself. So you press it like that and then like that. So, I mean, I can see, I like the feel of it when it pops. It's cool. It's got a good pop to it. So anyway, just another thing, you know, for the fidget, the fidget market, because there's a lot of fidget stuff out there, but it's kind of cool. So there's that. And then um, along those same lines, but not really, is a couple of card games. These are the mini, I guess. I don't know. But my friend Diane, I think it was, had sent me a box 
um, a, a one of these in Uno because I love Uno and it's just fun to play with, especially if you have like three or four people, it's even funner. Four people is the best, I think, but these are just like that. So these, I'm sure the Uno is definitely a name brand. Um, this one looks like Uno a whole lot, but it looks like it's different. It just says Dos Go. So it says pocket sized cards for on the go play. So, I don't know. I just think they're cool. And they don't really have to be for on the go. Like, you can totally play these in your house. And this one is Lowdown Go. So, I think Lowdown and Dose is the name of these cards. Tell me if I pronounced that wrong. Sorry about that if I did. But it said, this one says Lowest Score Wins. So, anyway, these are like name brand. So, for $1.25, I'm like, okay, I'll go ahead and grab those. So, there's the toys. I think that's all the toys I got. And then, I just got another two packs of these right here. It's the 48 count spoons. And I just like to have my drawer crammed plum full of those spoons. So, that's all that is. I do have my receipt. I did spend more than I thought I did. <laughs> but that's okay. It, it is what it is, guys, right? There's no sense in complaining or anything about it. It is what it is. We just have to go with the flow and roll with it, baby, don't we? So if you want my fetch referral code, let me know because you definitely need to scan those bad boys. We want some uh, free gift cards, right? Okay, so I grabbed two of these and I don't think I had never seen this brand. So it says it's a Gold Rush brand, jalapeno and cheese, smoky beef sticks. So this is gonna be a really good source of proteins. Um, it doesn't, it doesn't, it just gives the ingredients. It doesn't give like any of the um, nutritional facts, like how many carbs. Unless it's under the label, which is kind of weird because, you know, some meat sticks has six grams of carbs and some has like one or two. So I have no idea. I would think these would be low in carb because they are jalapeno and cheese. Both of those are low carb, but sometimes they put hidden sugars and stuff. So I don't know. But anyway, I grabbed them. I probably won't eat them anyway, but I used, I used to love to get those. Um, yeah. And then I saw these, I had never seen these before and I thought they're pretty cool. So it's just from the party, what is it? The fall cutout, what is this little area called? It's the party section, I guess. And you get five stars in each pack. So they only had red and silver, but I'm thinking like, what a great party decoration, you know, for my birthday. <laughs> And which is not till May, but like I love these and honestly, it'd be kind of cool just to hang all over your wall You know just make a big star wall. I don't know I'm a little bit ridiculous when it comes to decorating my bedroom because if you've seen my bedroom, you know, it's a little bit Extra it is uh, But that's how I like it. You know, that's my personal space. I got all my things that I love in there So, you know, that's how it is That's what your bedroom should be Okay, so I ran across some of these, which is the body armor. I felt like that this was a good deal. Um, so I got one of all the ones they have. Now, is this something that they usually have or is this new? Because honestly, I do not remember if this is something that they normally have. And I know like this is a name brand drink and like Kroger's, you know, if you're lucky, you can catch them 10 for 10, but most of the time you can't. So I feel like this is a good deal. And I, none of these are low sugar. So I'll be giving all these to my husband or son, you know, whoever wants to drink them. So I got one of the fruit punches and these are, how many fluid ounces? 16. So 16 fluid ounces. So I got one of the fruit punch, one blue raspberry, one orange mango. And I don't think none of these, it says superior hydration. So, you know, it, I don't think none of these are like low carb. This one was the one that I thought looked coolest. This one is strawberry grape. Just look how that packaging looks. I think it looks really cool, but it's definitely not low carb. They're 120 calories um, for one bottle. So, I mean, it's not that bad, but the carbs are probably out of this world. Yeah, like 23, 28. Yeah, 
which you know if you're if you're trying to do low carb they're not for you but if you're not like the rest of my fam you know they're gonna love these so i just grabbed those and i don't know if i'm gonna tick tock them or not so i don't want to throw them in the floor yet okay so let's go with this boro right here um i just got two rolls of the strong and soft yep so that's the Boro. I'm going to go ahead and toss it in the floor because I don't need to show that on TikTok either. If you guys are not following me on TikTok, go check me out. I usually do like a mini haul of my favorite items over there. So um, it's Twisted Gypsy 32. And also, if you're not following me on Instagram, it's Twisted Gypsy 32 as well. And I post just a lot of pictures like food pictures or just you know cool things that I buy or you know just stuff like that so go check me out um and this right here is I told you guys I was going to get me one of these backpacks because I am going to start doing some hiking in the woods um spring is on its way baby and I am so glad like before winter starts I'm always like yeah give me snow but once February gets here I'm done like I'm done like you know um but anyway these little backpacks right here are going to be perfect just to you know you can slip them on carry them like backpacks you can put your water in here a snack one of those meat sticks if you need to um just you know your phone a hand towel i do not hike without a hand towel because like i get really sweaty and i don't like sweat pouring in my eyes can't see like i get really sweaty hiking you know we got some beautiful mountains around here and i'm gonna burn them up this year so anyway this is gonna be my go-to backpack for that so i'm glad i found that and then i got one more of these shirts they didn't have any more in there um except this one right here and this is a 5x which i'm gonna see if my mother-in-law wants i got me one to sleep in and these are like extra soft and like they're not as stiff as the other brand that I was getting. Well, it's the same brand. It's the Gildan. I guess these are just made with uh, maybe a little extra polyester or something. But these are just so soft and they just feel so good. And if she doesn't want it, like um, I'll keep it just to sleep in. But I'm sure she's going to want it. So, yeah. There's that. And then I got my hubby four packs of these. As you guys know, this is uh, definitely a repurchase. It's the PS pistachios what pistachios pistachios but yeah never mind just never mind me i've got the inner mind of a eight nine ten year old i don't know like if i hear a funny word you know i'm like ah, yes pistachios anyway forget that um so looky here so i know i bought the pineapple ones before so i've never seen like a whole bag of just the blue raspberry haribo gold bears it says it's the hundredth hundredth anniversary edition this is the share size and they are gummy candies blue raspberry and yeah my son will eat those up and then this is something new haven't seen these listen to them they sound cool I don't know. Do they have something inside? I feel like they have something inside of the gumballs, and the, which is cute. Oh, it does. Oh, does it? No. Uh, I mean, I, it has to. You hear that? Yeah. So, it's magical dinosaur bubble gum. And when I shake it, I hear something inside. So, it probably has like maybe a little nerds type of candy in there or something it's from the sophie pops and, and gumdrops and i just think they're kind of cute definitely had never seen any of these they're good until october of next year which you know candy and then i grabbed these from a hubby he loves he loves his snacks this is just the cars brand which i know is a good brand the american trail mix but this is just salted peanuts so he likes to snack at nighttime so i thought i'd go ahead and grab these for him yeah so put those over there okay now let's see what i found here so i found a couple more packs of stickers like for my journaling and my planners and stuff like that number one i have had these before but i've used them all up but I just absolutely love them. They're so boho. I'm just, I'm just loving them, especially for some reason, this one right here. Like, I love that, that sticker. And these are just the pop-up, what are they called? Um, 
they kind of pop up a little bit, you know, but that's okay. Um, they still close good. This one's really cute too. They're all really cute, honestly. So I grabbed those and then I grabbed these because I thought they were super cute. They are, you know how they have like the themed stickers? Well, this one is an artist themed sticker and I am loving these. All of these colors on here are sparkly. I don't know if it's coming out. I think this is the cutest sticker right here and they are so like well detailed. This says great artist. I love art. Create. You got some little paint tubes. You got a, um, what's that thing they hold? Oh man. <laughs> yeah, one of those. You got some colored pencils here. I like this right here. It says, creativity is magic. I love that. Look at the little paint tubes with the little paint coming out. Unique. Love that. But this right here, look at that. E not an easel because that's what you set it on. It, like this is the easel. Um, I don't know. You know what I'm talking about. And then I hauled some sort of like this the other day. Um, and I've had some of these before that I've used in my planners. But this one here... Like, look at that. That is everything. And this one, oh my gosh, it has a paisley vibe to it. This one, this one, oh my goodness. They're so pretty. I just can't. I love those stickers. And they are so perfect for putting in your planners or your journals. I just love them. It just takes them up a notch, right? Um, I sent Dee Dee's uh, Valentine's bag. I, I know it's a little early. Valentine's Day is Monday. I sent her Valentine's bag to her, and um, I found this just now, and I think it's cute. It's a large, and Dee Dee's a large girl, so this is going to be good for her. Let me crack my window. I'm dying here. Um, this is going to be good for her. Um, I love the I love the look of it though. It's just so cute, right? I love dogs in clothes or dogs wearing bandanas and stuff. I just love that. I just think it's so cute and creative. And then I got these right here. These are carrot shaped gift bags. So I thought I would make just, I don't know, honestly. I hate to fill these bad boys with candy because you know, gosh, all that sugar, you know, it just makes the kids crazy and wacko, but I'm like, just one day, you know, just like Easter, you know, jelly beans would be so cute in these. Or, you know what I love, which I have got to steer clear of, those Cadbury, those mini Cadbury chocolate eggs that has like the, the shell, on, not like the Cadbury cream eggs, but the tiny Cadbury eggs. And they have like a shell, like a hard shell. And on the inside, it's just like that Cadbury chocolate. Oh my gosh. Like, those are so good. Like, it's my favorite Easter treat. And I've even seen them already this year. I spotted them, uh, but I didn't get them. But anyway, oh, these filled up with that would be so good. Yum. Let me know if you know what I'm talking about. Those things are my weakness. So, um, they had these new Kiss Nails. Now, this is the short... And it says active square and I got these for and I got some longer ones before for those but the sticker or the sort of like color street but the ones that Dollar Tree had I, I, that I think are so cute I want to wear those but for some reason my nail beds are like wavy and stuff just from probably where I've worn like fake nails so long like my nail beds are not smooth and I think that's probably why those don't like to stick to my nails so I thought I'll just put these on and then just put those over top of it which is a little bit more trouble but not as not as much as these like it took me a good two hours to do these bad boys. Like, I feel like they should last a couple weeks, but, and I love them. I absolutely love them. I, I tried to make them look as galaxy and night sky as I could, but they are like not perfect. And you know, it is what it is, right? Um, I'm not perfect, but that's for sure. And that was my first time doing these. So I'm thankful. And then I got these napkins. I figured they'll match those wall decor stars really good. And look at these. Like, I love those. They're so pretty. So I'm going to put these with those. We'll see. We'll see what happens with that. Okay, let's see what's in this bag. Oh, yeah. My hubby said 
I need some more razors. And I'm like, okay, I've got to because I'm going. Well, lo and behold, I dug in the very bottom and I found some more five packs. Like all of the ones on top was four packs. And I'm just like cramming my hand all the way to the bottom and pulled one out. And it was a five pack. I'm like, yes! You know, because, yeah, you'd much rather get five than four, right? So I kept digging and kept digging until I found five packs of these razors for him so he is going to be super thrilled these are his faves and i love that they all have five razors in because you hate if you're you know doing if you're having to buy if you're used to buying something with five in it and all of a sudden they switch it up and only put four in there it's a bummer to keep having to pay the same price or even more so I was super glad that I could find these and I should have got all they had with a five in it just for the future because apparently they're all going to be switching to four. So anyway, um, I grabbed a couple of more of the contact lens cases. My son needed one and I like to switch mine out like once a month. So I got me the avocado one because avocado, you know, yes. And then I got this. This is the, the most guyish one I could find. Like, I know that dark green is kind of guyish, but it has hearts and avocado. But this one, you know, is, is more guyish. So, you know, take it or leave it, right? Take it or leave it. Um, and then I got me these hair clips because I've been seeing this thing on TikTok where you put your hair up like this and somehow you wrap it around and wrap it back around somehow and then you do this number and it makes like a little bun looking thing i want to try it and i'm like none of my clips were just the perfect size so i feel like these are going to be just the perfect size for that so yeah i've got to try that trend you know we gotta try those trends out so there's that okay so, I just got a couple of two liters. When I was getting them, I was like, you know, that's really not a bad deal. Seriously. Because if you go into Dollar, not Dollar General. If you go into uh, Dollar General, they're still a dollar. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure. So, really, it's not the best buy. But, I'll just remember this for the future. I'm going to start doing more shopping at Dollar General and probably more Dollar General hauls, honestly. So anyway, this is the Sunkissed Orange. So my, my hubby got a couple of these for my son the other day and I think he even had some of the, the grape that they have, which I got a grape too. And it's just the Sunkissed Grape Soda. Yum! Like, Drinking grape soda or orange soda even really takes me back to being a kid. I absolutely love it. I would like to have some diet grape just to have like for um, with dinner or something, you know. I just think that would be so good. So, so good. Okay. See what else we got here. Let me dig into this one. Okay, that's kind of heavy. What's in there? Oh, yes guys guys look what i found looky here so this is the hand soap the adorbs little hand soaps for easter so i found the chick and the bunny which i love um let's see what scent they are and let me get a whiff of these just to see so the chick it says hand soap come on really the Christmas ones told us how what kind they were, didn't they? Because I remember, like, there was the gingerbread, and there was the uh, cranberry. I think Santa was cranberry, but these doesn't say, so I'm just going to smell it, and I'll let you guys know what it smells like, okay? Lemon? Citrus or lemon? Oh, and it smells good, let me just say. It smells really good. So, citrus or lemon? One of the two. Lemon Verbino, Lemon Zest, Citrus, Forever. I don't know. We'll just give it a name. And this one, let me just make sure. Yeah, I'm not seeing it. These are so cute. I love sitting around, sitting stuff like this around the bathroom. You know, the kids, they just love stuff like this. Forget the kids, okay? I love stuff like this. Like, come on, it makes me happy in my soul. Let's see. Same. Same smell. So, citrus or lemon or something like that. Yeah. Ta-da! 
Okay, so there's those. And then everybody was saying what a good deal these was. And I'm like, let me grab a couple more. Um, the Sea Mineral and Blue Iris. And this is the only kind they had. I don't know if they have another kind scent or whatever. So it's just the Gentle Moisture with aloe and shea. And yeah, so I thought I'd grab two more while they have them because they're probably going to go. You know how that goes. And then I got this just to, I don't know, honestly. Um, Felicia, she doesn't like to eat really popcorn because I don't know if they're if they're GMO free. I don't know if they're gluten free or not. Probably not. Oh, it does say gluten free, honestly. I don't know if she would want them though just because like I don't think she likes to eat popcorn because it gets in her teeth. So, and I think my hubby's the exact same way. Honestly, I love popcorn and I will go for it and just get me a, a flosser, you know, after. Enjoy it and then floss. But anyway, this is drizzled popcorn, cold stone creamery, yes, cake batter. Yes, you know that's going to be good. It says sweet and salty kettle corn with cake batter flavoring drizzle or cake batter flavored drizzle no um high fructose corn syrup no artificial colors how could that be because can you see what they look like uh made with cane sugars and it's gluten free so i may ask her but i'm really have a feeling she's gonna say nope no thanks but we'll see um, and then these are the, uh, I told you guys I got more of these. So these are the ones, I think these are so cute. Um, it's the little hot air balloons and look at the bunny head and the little chick. So these are perfect just to decorate with. And then these right here, I'm going to give to Fifi because like I say, they fall off of my, um, sorry, I, sometimes I get distracted. They fall off of my kitchen mirror, uh, or my kitchen mirror, my bathroom mirror. So yeah, I'll just give them to her. This bunny is so cute. I love the pink and the chick and the flowers and the grass. I just love that. So yeah, I'm going to show all of these Easter things on uh, TikTok all together. I think that'd be good. And then I found this and so I had to go ahead and grab it. It's the S, and S is for Sherry. So, th that's my name, just in case you didn't know. It's Sherry, but you can call me Gypsy. I like that. Um, so, anyway, S is for Sherry, and I just think it's cute. Um, I feel like last year I got a purple one as well with an S, but I don't know. I always donate all of my holiday stuff, like, after the holiday. So, um, yeah. Find a place to put her. Okay. There's that bag. Now, the other day, let's see, I saw, let me just start with this. The other day, I was in there, and I think this is really cute. It's from Fashion Angels. It's watercolor posters, and these are adorable. Like, look at these, look at these. These are Greenbrier, but look at these, how you can make them look tie-dyed. I think they're so pretty, and it comes with this little palette of palette that's what that was on that sticker but this comes with you know all of these colors which is a pretty good array of colors and they're just light enough to make it look tie-dyed so i think these are really cute i might sit down with jack at the kitchen table and me and her paint those up um i saw these and i could not resist so these are valentine centered or valentine themed paper cups with lids so if you need to take a drink bye-bye with you uh, which I do a lot um, which I'm gonna have to hide these in my room but let me just show you how great these are let me just take one of these out there's five in here which these are mine okay I'm the only one that really likes stuff like this my, my son would probably you know just get rid of them but this is you know you get your cup your little cup with the hearts all over it. How cute is it though? Really? It's so cute. And then it comes with the little hot sleeve, you know, just like your little um, Starbucks or something with your little hot sleeve. How cute that says love. And then of course it comes with your top that you stick on. But I love these and I thought that's really a good deal for those. I love them. So I will hide them. These are mine. 
Sorry, they're mine. They're too cute to share. Okay, next. I just, oh, another receipt, guys. Remember, referral code, it will be in the description box too. Um, I just saw these and I thought maybe Ricky might like this. This is cute. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna make Easter bags or not. I don't know. I'm just like, I just don't know. If I do, this is gonna be in his because I think it's cute. You put the thing on the end and then you mash it down and I guess this is gonna shoot out and roll across the floor. So that's what I'm hoping for anyway. But I had never saw these before up in the Dollar Tree. So I'm like, give me that. Well, let me have it. And then I needed some more of the aluminum sheets, which I also need some more of the heavy duty aluminum because I've been making a lot of bacon in the oven and that just makes for a little bit better cleanup. But anyway, this right here, I prefer the Reynolds sheets and you only get 25, but they were out. So I'm like, well, I gotta have those because I gotta have them. I use them a lot and I gotta have them. And then last in this bag is this right here. It's just one of the cake pans with the lids. This is for that strawberry cake mix I got and that hot pink icing that I'm gonna do up for Valentine's Day. I thought I would put it in here. I was looking for a pink one of these on top, which would have really been cute, but they didn't have any. So now I got the cake mix, the icing. I've got the pan to put it in. And if you remember, I bought cute little Valentine paper plates and napkins to match which is going to be dessert on Valentine's Day. So, because I ain't trying to go out on Valentine's Day, and we don't really go out to dinner on Valentine's Day anyway. Like, we just don't. He doesn't go out to dinner at all anyway, so that's why I take Jack sometimes with me. And then, last but least, last but not least in this bag, I thought that was, but are these, these right here. And me and my daughter was somewhere, and I feel like it was Walmart or something. She's like, oh, cool. Have you ever saw these? I'm like, yeah, Dollar Tree has those. And she's like, what? She's like, next time you see them, get me one. I'm like, okay. So anyway, it's just the... Go ahead. Y'all can read the top there. I don't know how to pronounce it. Gua sha massager. I don't know. Agusha. You know me. I don't know. But anyway, it just says apply your favorite facial serum or moisturizer as usual, then lightly massage the gua sha tool in a long swing, swiping motion across cheeks, forehead, chin, and nose. So I don't know what this is all about. I've never applied my moisturizer with a tool, like, like a rock tool. I don't even know. I don't, I'm gonna have to ask her because like she knew, seemed to know what it was all about and like I did not. So anyway, um, let's see what else I got here. Okay, so I've got some Kool-Aid gum. I think there's three packs, the Kool-Aid gum. Yep. And then I got some cute little, I just think these were really cute. These are barrettes. And I just think that'd be really cute to pull your sides back with. Aren't they cute? Like they're pearls and they got little mini diamonds in between each pearl. And I just think they're really pretty. So I have quite a collection of hair clips and I don't really wear them much either. So, you know, um, I got this Bic Correct It. This is a good deal. Um, I did also get the Bic Tape correcting tape and I've been using that but it's not gonna last forever so I'll just have this as a backup and then I got this this is all day pain relief it's the naproxen I can't remember why I got this there was a reason I don't know if it was to I mean because I already got some in my car I already got some in my purse do I have some in my purse maybe it's my purse I don't know but I have you know I've been having a lot of pain and stuff and if, last night like my arm but it, it's not it's not a heart attack or anything like that because this has been going on for years so if it was a heart attack it would already have happened so anyway my arm just kept coming and going just kind of hurting and I just I don't know. I hate to take, I don't know. I just hate to take stuff. I didn't take anything. Okay. And then I got two of these, which is the Bisquick Buttermilk 
complete biscuit mix. And I just thought this would be easy to make whenever I'm making like biscuits and gravy. Um, just like drop biscuits for the fam. Maybe fry some eggs up, make some bacon in the oven. And just make these biscuits drop. Because last time I made them, they went over really good. It was the cheddar, cheddar ones though that I got from there. So I'm like, I'm going to go ahead and grab them too. And then here is something really cute. Like I got... These two bags, um, the cross body bags. This one is super cute. Wait a minute, they're tangled. Well, it doesn't matter. This one is super cute because it has the bikes on it. I love the big bikes with the baskets and the flowers. I just think they're so cute. And then this one, I love this. I just think this is really cute. I love the colors. It's like, um, it's not really like a black black. It's more like a dark gray honestly because this strap is black so you can kind of see it's kind of a really dark gray but anyway i love these little bags they're good for a lot of different things and then i grabbed these because this is cool so this is from amscan these are called beverage napkins but honestly <laughs> these are just napkins um, you can use them, like if you're throwing a party, for people to set their drinks on, I guess. But, I mean, you can also wipe your mouth with them whenever you are eating dinner, you know what I'm saying? So, it's a big pack, a big party pack, 125 beverage napkins. So, I thought that was a really good deal. Yeah. And then, I got some Valentine stickers, which these were supposed to have went to Jack's school. Uh-oh. I sent her stuff over Monday. They're decorating boxes tomorrow. So if I give her these tomorrow, she can still give them to her teacher. So that's what I'll do. And then I got these because I'm like, this is something that I just feel like you don't see a whole lot. This is the earphones with a microphone and I know a lot of times like gaming people need a microphone to be able to talk to other gamers so I just got these just to keep in a drawer because you know sometimes the need arises and these are the over-the-ear ones so I think that's kind of cool or if you are out walking you know wearing headphones and somebody calls you you can just talk you know so those are cool and last but not least in this bag, I've got these right here. It's just the Valentine's chocolate. These are the chocolates that are from, um, 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 hold on, is it Germany? Yes, German chocolate baby. So these are so cute. I absolutely love these. Um, anyway, I don't know what I'm gonna do with them to tell you the truth. Okay guys, we got one bag left. Let's bust it out, okay? Let's bust it out. Um, these right here, I got two packs of these. Um, two for me, but then I got two packs, I'm pretty sure, for, yeah, I know I do, for the 17K giveaway. I see we're already at 16.1, guys. So I am gonna have a lot of goodies, hopefully tomorrow or Saturday when me and Fifi's out at Charleston. I'm hoping Charleston is still a dollar. I don't know. If you live in Charleston, West Virginia, and you know if they're a dollar or a dollar twenty-five, please let me know down here in the comments. Um, but anyway, these are going to be going in my 17K giveaway just because they're fabulous. And I love those. I love those. I am getting hot. Okay, and then these right here I thought were cute. This is the Heart Grape Pines. You get five pieces in here, and I love these. I think they're really cool. I don't want to open them, but I'll probably donate them since it's almost Valentine's Day. But anyway, I love those. And then I got these for Jack. Uh-oh, we got more Kool-Aid gum. Gosh, that's five packs. And then I also have two Airheads gum for my hubs. And this is for my hubs. Wow, I got a lot of gum. Um, I got these for Jack to give to her little sisters. They're twins, and they... Hold on. I am sorry, but... Something's got to give here. Oh, I'm hot. Um, they love Blue's Clues. So we got her, we got them some um, little Blue's Clues notepad electronic phones for Christmas. So I just thought she could give them these just to carry around. You know, they're cute. They're blue, blue from Blue's Clues. And I was hoping I could find magenta, but I didn't find her. I don't know if they make her. If they make her, let me know, guys, because I'll be on the lookout. 
but these are just super cute so got those and then let's see here oh guys this is something i have been looking for for so long i ended up getting three packs of these this is the color changing i don't know if you remember me talking about them a lot i mean like i have mentioned these so much these are the color changing um, LED tea light candles. They last 120 hours, which is a heck of a long time. And you know me, I'm all about color anyway. I would so much rather have something that looks like this rather than just regular old white. Um, yeah, I'm like that on my Christmas tree too. But anyway, I absolutely love these and I was so excited to find these again. So I got three packs of these bad boys. Yes. And then last but not least is this right here. And this is just the donuts, um, the heart-shaped donuts Valentine's decoration. So let me just go up through here so you guys can see. It's so sweet, it says. And then the donuts are super duper cute. Look at those. So anyway, you can use these as something to decorate with or you can take them apart and use them, you know, some other way. I, I was just going to hang them on the wall, but look at this. Like, what, two, day, three days until Valentine's Day? Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Four days. You know, what's the point at this, at this point, you know? I mean, I don't know. Anyway, guys, that is my very long haul. You won't see another one until Sunday, but I'm sure me and Fifi will be showing y'all our favorite item from each store like we normally do. And we'll also be doing a... Um, goodwill haul in that video as well so that's gonna be fun to do and i'm excited and the weather's working with us you know it might be rainy but that's okay um anyway guys just want to say thanks for watching and give me a like down here hit that thumbs up leave me a comment down below and until next time guys bye